welcome back to my channel. So I finally started moving my filming setup into my new filming room at the new house. This is my first time trying to figure out the lighting in here. So bear with me on that. Anyway, I have some liquid lipstick swatches for you today and I am so excited to share this with you because I have been using this brand since they first came out with liquid lipsticks. I am of course talking about Atomic Makeup. One of my very, very, very first videos on this channel is swatching their liquid lipsticks and they were under the name Lonely Planet at the time. The video is very cringy, but I will link it up here. And for a while I was on their PR list and I got a couple of their liquid lipsticks and then they kind of disappeared and now they've relaunched and they're back. I have always really loved their formula, so let's hope these new formulas are just the same if not better. They sent these liquid lipsticks to me in exchange for an Instagram reel actually, but I realized that a lot of my followers on Instagram don't follow me on YouTube and a lot of my followers on YouTube don't follow me on Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, you really should. But I thought I would swatch them here for you anyway. So they sent me eight colors. Their new logo is this very like groovy feel situation and their liquid lipstick packaging has definitely changed. It has changed a number of times over the years, but it has always been in a very clear tube. Um, this is more of like a frosted plastic tube, so it's not, I don't think, exactly the same color as you're seeing. And then there's like these little designs on the cap and the foot applicator. Um, is this doe foot now. I want to say for a while they were in a doe foot and then they were in this like paddle uh, applicator and I guess now they're back um, as a doe foot. So these are all their silky matte formulas and I believe all the colors they sent me um, were previously available. So I'm really glad to see that they did not do away with their original colors or rename them because that always gets so confusing and their original colors were so good anyway. So without further ado, let's get swatching and I will voice over my opinion. So let's talk about the scent real quick. There is sort of like this sweet, almost vanilla frosting type smell to this product. And that is pretty consistent with what I remember them being before the relaunch. I really like that it smells like vanilla frosting, but it doesn't taste like that. So don't just like eat it. Um, this liquid lipstick atomic is the only one out of all of them that stained my lips and it stained my lips like a bright pink. I don't remember their liquid lipsticks ever staining at all, let alone this bad, but I've never tried that atomic color. So I don't know if that's like new to that lipstick or not, but all of these colors are super opaque. And so even though my lips are stained bright pink, I still feel like the colors that you're seeing now are still accurate to what the colors actually are because they are just so opaque. None of them were streaky, even the lighter colors. And that is, again, consistent with what I remember their lipsticks being. The Silky Matte formula, I feel like, is very true to their name. It does feel like silk. It almost feels like mousse, super lightweight on your lips. And it is still a matte, but it's not like a dry matte. Like, you're not going to feel it tightening around your lips. You're not going to feel like your lips are cracking. And it does have pretty good staying power. Although, you know, if you're eating, like, really greasy foods, it will still come off. But... The trade-off between the staying power and how comfortable it is, I think is totally worth it. A lot of these colors I did have before their relaunch, and I feel like the colors are still accurate. This Lexington color is one of my all-time favorite colors, and it just kind of goes with everything and is perfect for autumn. So that is all eight colors that I have. Um, I know that they have a lot more colors on their website and I know they're working on re-releasing some of their colors from previous launches as well as new colors. Uh, one of my personal favorites, besides this Lexington color, uh, is X-Ray, which is their black. I don't know if they've already re-released it. I hope they plan to if it's not already up. If you've enjoyed them in the past, highly recommend you pick them up and check out their new formula. If you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a like and subscribe down below. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye!